The subject of this video, chromatography, is primarily a method of separating a mixture based upon differences in the physical properties of that mixture. There are many types of chromatography, most of which will separate a mixture based either upon the sizes of the molecules in the mixture, or as in the case we will demonstrate in this video, the strength of the interaction between the sample being analyzed and the chromatography stationary phase, which will be discussed further later in the video. As with many complicated sounding or unfamiliar terms in the scientific world, it is useful to take a look at the root words. Chroma is derived from the Latin word for color, while the graphy term is related to the writing or drawing of lines or figures. This root word actually highlights what we will see in today's experiment as we will see lines of colors separate from each dye mixture. What is the method of separation? Briefly, in a chromatography experiment, the mobile phase moves up the paper, grabs the sample, and carries the sample up the paper. Samples made up of a mixture will have components that will travel up the stationary phase at different rates depending on the sample stationary phase interaction. A strong interaction between the stationary phase and a sample component will make the sample move up less over the course of the experiment. What are the parts of a chromatography experiment? In general, a chromatography experiment will contain three components stationary phase, which is paper in this experiment. The mobile phase is in general a liquid that travels across the stationary phase during the course of the experiment. And perhaps most importantly, the sample of interest, which will be carried by the mobile phase and interact with the stationary phase during the course of the experiment.